super happy because we have found some lucky beans. I was so excited I nearly jumped off the vehicle and Craig looked at me like I was definitely going crazy. So this beautiful plant that we're looking at, it is one of my favorite colorful things around and part of the reason is because we, it's People think that it originated here in South Africa, but we also find it in tropical areas like where I come from. So let me just show you a bit more clearly, if I don't die in the process first. This beautiful, beautiful plant, let me just, maybe this one it's easier. So it has very beautiful bright purple flowers during um, the summertime and spring, but then as it dries out, then it reveals this very beautiful seed. So you see, it's that typical seed. If you've ever gone to any tropical areas, you'll see lots of people will sell, sell them on the sides of the roads and they're black where they are attached to the to the pod and then they are red where they are not. I think there might be some more down here that have maybe fallen off. I'm just gonna grab a couple of seeds just so that I can show you guys a bit better. Oh, I think I only managed to grab two. Come little seed, come be famous. All right. It's a bit of a complicated area. So if you see here, tiny little, can you see them from there, Craig? Yeah. Okay, so tiny little seeds, very beautiful red color around here. And then the tip where they were attached to the seed you see is black. So like we have learned pretty much everything in nature that has a very bright color, you've got to think twice before you eat it or you do anything with it. And this, tiny little seed is actually very 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 poisonous so funny enough you see it hangs from the from the plant and a lot of the times they give it to children to use as a toy but if ingested my goodness they the things that would happen to you you get apparently your bowels can swell and you get very st st uh, very bad stomach pains and colics and diarrhea and you can start vomiting and eventually if you eat too many of them you could potentially die from them this is how just how dangerous they are so i know them as lucky beans i was shown them by one of my shangan friends that says that i just had to keep this ones in my pocket if i ever wanted to find good stuff or whatever it is that i was looking for so i believe some of the guys have found some potential lion tracks heading into Wuyatela. So I'm going to hold on to this ones and maybe they will, you know, send Taylor very, very good luck. So seeing we're working as a team, I'm keeping one for her and one for me. And that way, hopefully we'll be able to see more things. But they only start coming or becoming obvious now during the winter time. And like I said, when everything is nice and yellow, something that's that bright orange or bright red will definitely strike. And because they are a creeper, you don't always find them. They'll grow mixed up with the vegetation and around everywhere else. So the fact that we saw them over the long grass, we were very, very excited about it.